Lockie, not the prettiest of games, but you'll take the five points tonight. Yeah. <laughs> um, look, Quinn, Quinn's came out, you know, quite strong in that first half, and we they, they really lived off our errors, and we gave them plenty. Um, and that was basically what our halftime chat was about, just making sure that we play our footy and limit our mistakes. And we did that in the second half, and you know, we got a few few bounces of the ball, and um, you know, we kept them scoreless, and that's what we wanted. I was going to say, what did Rob say at halftime? Did you seem a little bit different after the break? You came out with a bit more between the teeth. Yeah, look, I think we blew out a, a few cobwebs. Um, we, most of us had had a couple of weeks off and, and reju rejuvenated and we were a little bit rusty and uh, the first first half uh, probably showcased that. And then we, we regathered half time, Rob said, you know, challenged us to, to limit our mistakes and that's what we did and uh, to get five points is, is really pleasing. Top of the table tonight, it's a nice boost to take into Saracens next week, which you know you'll have to be better for. I didn't even know we were, but yeah. Um, Look, yeah, we, we will be better next week. There's no no doubt about that. Um, we've got to be better. And, you know, we'll, we'll continue to work hard to make sure that's the, that's the case. And, look, at the end of the day, we know we can be better. We will be better. And we're sitting at the top, so things are going all right. What about Harlequins today? They, they really put a match up for you. Yeah, they did. They always do. Um, you know, they're, they're a top quality side and they're fourth at the moment. Uh, they've got some really good mix between the old wise heads um, in James Hall, Will and Ward. And, uh, and then we've got some of that young talent coming through in the Walkers and the Smiths. So look, they've, got, they've got a really nice little team there, a nice little unit. And um, they, they've been challenging tens all year, so I don't see why that won't continue from here on in. That's almost, a, well, it is a year unbeaten here at Sandy Park, the last time side to win here at Bordeaux. Um, Making home fortress is key though, isn't it? You're, any successful side will build off a home home base. Yeah, it is. I think um, we, we, we enjoy playing here. The crowd lifts us, there's no doubt about it. We have one of the most passionate supporter bases in, in world rugby. Um, you know, when when the going gets tough and the chop starts up, it, it gives us a, a, an extra boost. And uh, we love our fans and, and we try and repay them as best we can. And, I think that, that record here at home now sort of speaks to, to that and um, hopefully it continues for a long time to come. That's quite a claim to make, Lockie, having played all around the world. And that, what, what does it make it so special? Uh, look, I, I, I couldn't tell you. I, I wouldn't be able to put my finger on it. It's just, um, you know, when we come in before the game, the chop starts up and, you know, you're, run, you're running in and, you know, you get goosebumps. And, um, you know, we've got fans who, who turn up every week and, uh, send us Christmas gifts or you know walk 100 metres from our car inside just to say good day and wish us luck and um, you know it's a really special place with a, a you know a really passionate supporter base. Um, we're, we're lucky, we're fortunate, and we were trying to try and repay that. And I think the more we try and repay that, the the better our fans are. So um, you know we're we're looking after them as much as they're looking after us, and hopefully that continues. You talked about blowing the cobwebs out. Saracens next week, you know what's coming up here, don't you? <laughs> Yeah, look, there aren't too many surprises in uh, such a long season anymore. But um, yeah, look, as I said, we're, we're going to focus on us this week. Uh, we need to be better, and we will be better, and uh, that's what this week will be about. Yeah.